Hey YouTube, how you doing? My name is the Asian Link, and welcome to another episode of Spyro Enter the Dragonfly. In this episode, we're gonna get this kid's kite, and uh, let's get started. Now, I fucking hate getting this kite. It's... I don't know why, but for me, it's one of the most difficult things in the game. And I just... I don't know, I hate it. Oh, fuck. Come on, Spyro. Damn, camera ang... Bad camera angles are bad. Okay. Fuck! Spyro, what are you doing? You fucking drunk. I swear to God. Alright. Go. Ah! Ah! Uh, there we go. I don't know how to get this kite, honestly. This is, like, to me, one of the most difficult parts of this game. Is trying to get this kid's kite. Because it seems that, like, nowhere you go can you actually get it. You may have to do it from here. I'm not really too sure. Alright, let's try from here. Yeah, you see, like, I don't I don't know. It's weird. Well, we'll take care of that later. Ouch. So, let's just, let's just keep on keeping on. We'll figure that out later. Alright. In here, we have a couple of Riptox. One big one and two little ones. Nothing too, you know, nothing too menacing, so nothing you really have to take, you know, too much uh, caution over. Just make sure that you breathe fire on the big one, otherwise he will not die. Remember, you cannot, um, y you cannot just tackle him like the other little ones. See, like, this, here, like, you can't tackle him doesn't work that way. Anyway, over here, we're gonna meet very soon another mechanic of all the Spyro games that I'm pretty sure is pretty well hated. But first we gotta get over here. See, look. I cannot just run into it. I have to breathe fire. And I sacrificed part of my health for you guys. I hope you enjoyed that. As you can see, whenever you get hit, sparks turn to a different color. Eventually, you will lose sparks which is a bitch. So, you want to be careful there. Oh, shit! Right, I don't know what happened there. <laughs> oh, dear God. Let's, uh... Alright, so we start from here now. Okay, Sparks is at full health. Good. Ow. We'll work on uh, that kite later. Because I know the kid says something about, you know, finding his friend's kites. But we'll get into that. gotta keep on going back through here now I mean, it's nothing too overwhelming just make sure you don't die there now coming up is the part of the game that I'm that I say everyone hates but first we got to talk to this guy you are a dragon wise beyond your years. May the dragon spirits guide you on your way. Thank you, Jet. As you can tell, this one was named after Jet Lee. But anyway, here we go. Ah, <coughs> Spyro. In trouble again, I see. What a surprise. Dragons in danger or something like that? Well, you'll have to pay me 200 gems to cross this mighty large chasm to reach any of the other dojos. Although I may be practicing compassion, money still has my soul. Yeah, this is money bags. It's kind of a dick. Yeah, alright. Thanks, Spyro. These gems are music to my ears and will do wonders as inspiration for my poetry. But look, Spyro, even I know some magic when properly motivated. See, look at this guy, he's such a dick. Literally, you have to pay that son of a bitch. Alright. You die. Alright, that's, that's some health there, could. 
Now, pretty soon you're going to see something a little new. And, well, that is as soon as I free the dragon that's imprisoned here. I don't remember this one's name. We've already seen... We've already seen Miyagi, Bruce, uh, Jackie, and Jet. I forget what this one's name is. I really do. Well, let's find out. Good work, Spyro-san. Those rip talks don't seem to be much of a challenge for you. Perhaps you should contemplate a career as a dragon sensei. It could be your density. I mean, your destiny. Now, I will open that gate. That, it appears, is my density. I mean, destiny, Spyro. And you guys thought my jokes were bad. This guy brings shit jokes to a whole new level, doesn't he? Seriously? Density. Anyway, let's head over here. Now, over here, it doesn't look like you're able to cross. But, keep in mind that you are. You can cross, and that's actually the only way to get across. A little harder to get back, however. Where is he? Oh my god, I hate these guys. I hate fireflies with a pet. Oh, come on. Blah, 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 bonsai, blah. Can you save my kite? Blah, de, blah, blah, blah. Alright. Let's, uh, let's keep on going here. And try to get this little fucker. Now, these are little health pots. Um, they hold butterflies in them, which, as you know, Sparks eats. So, they're very good for that. For, uh, if, if you're low on health and you happen to come across one of these. Oh my god. Thank you. Hey, it's an annoying dragonfly that I absolutely hate collecting. I like collecting all of them, actually, because they're kind of assholes. They run away from you and all this other, you know, some shit. All right, so this is how we uh, get to this this kite here. Now, as you can see, it is uh, basically a teleport. Uh, not a teleporter, but a, uh, a booster. And what this does is it allows you, or should allow you, to get up onto there. Alright, that was close. There we go, I think I got a good chance at it this time. Nope. I forget how I'm supposed to get up to here. I don't remember if it's later in the level or something. Let's see. You said my kite, it sure is hot out here. Why are you laughing? I breathe fire on you, you little shit. That doesn't do it. Alright, we'll come back to these kites. This whole kite thing is retarded. It really is. I don't like it. Whoa, oh, frame rate. I don't even see my frame rate on here. Right. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's keep going here. Alright, now we're by money bags. Somehow. Alright, kill this mofo. Alright, there's a dragonfly right there. So this one's not too hard to get. As long as he, you know, he likes to turn around. I'll put it that way. He's gotta turn around somewhere. There we go! Where'd he go? 
He like went into the wall. That's just not fair. Whatever. Thank you, fairy. We'll uh, we'll just keep him in mind, okay? Because for some reason he decided to teleport into the wall. Maybe I can get him out. I don't know. Oh yeah, bubble breath doesn't work on anything but dragonflies, as you can tell. Now this is uh, another challenge portal that we have. This is actually a tank mission. I really enjoy it. I think it's fun. Anyway. Glitch number one in the game. Which means we'll have to come back to dra that dragonfly. So let's switch back to our fire breath in the meantime. Oh, he teleported over there. Look at that. Almost had him. Come on, you little shit. There we go. Got him. Hey, get Cinder. Good, we got Cinder. Awesome. That's that's what I like to what I like to hear. Okay, that one. Ouch. These are sometimes actually hard to miss because they look like they're part of the fence. But alas. Let's keep going. And right here is a group of, uh... I guess they're baskets or something that make, like, crashing glass noises, but whatever. There's a group of those right there that you can do. That'll get you a bunch of gems. Now, the thing is, you do want to try to collect all the gems in each level. Okay, that guy I usually can get on my first try, but, uh... Where did he go? Oh, really? You're just gonna stay there. Gotcha. Second try. Cloudy. Hey, it's Cloudy! Now, down here, you gotta be careful. Because literally, this entire place is one gem. And if you just run straight, you'll fall off. So be very careful there. Now, continuing onward here, I heard a big rip talk. I think he's up there. Now, there's the portal to get home. And here we have, again, another cricket. Again, if, you know, if you're careful in this game, there's no reason you should ever really get hit too much. No, I... Yeah. Ooh, close. I don't want to be uh, defrosting this guy just yet, because if we look... Where is it? I think it's over here. You should be able to see an area with, uh, for a kid with a kite. I swear there's one over here. I'm not seeing it right now. Whatever. Alright, let's defrost this guy. You have done well, little dragon. Freeing the dragon senses took much courage. I think this baby dragonfly will be safe Good, now you. Chow is Chow Yun Fat. I don't know what Toshiro hey, is. This is the only one I don't know, actually. Is Toshiro. I'm gonna have to look that one up. Remember Spiral. Find and return the remaining baby dragonflies. They are the fortune of the dragon realms. Okay. There's the kite. Good, I found it. This is the first one you can actually get to. Oh, I missed it! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, now I gotta talk to this guy. Spyro, you're just in time to help me. Archie and Russ were playing with my Kai and the Riptox came, kicked it in my face and threw it up in the air. I hate it. If you could breathe ice like a big bad dragon, maybe you could get my kite down. So, basically what he's saying is we can't do this until we have ice. Which makes sense on why we couldn't do this. So let's just read that one more time, just to make sure of this. I think he said ice, if you could breathe ice. Breathe ice, yeah. Maybe you can get it down. Now, I, this one I believe you actually can get down early. 
but I'm not sure how well that works. That, that would be why I wasn't able to get the other ones, because I did not have the Ice Breath yet. Spoiler alert, you get Ice Breath. <laughs> right, let's just fly over here. See, there's nothing you can really do. You can headbutt. I'm right next to it, but I can't get it, okay? So, Ice Breath is the key for that. I actually forgot that. Anyway. Let's keep on going here through the level. Now we have to make it over here. Now here's the area where to get back. However, I'm not doing that yet. We'll come back to that. Because the door should now be open right here. There should be, um, if you remember in the beginning of the level, there was an area we couldn't get to. Well, that's right here. See? Look how this works out. And then you can go up here and get some stuff as well, which I'm going to get because I actually forgot about it. Well, not forgot, but I thought uh, that, you know, you had to do something before you could get up here. Apparently, I was wrong. It's just a rip talk and like some I guess these are barrels. Yep, cool. Let's uh let's exit this area and then next episode or next time anyway, we will probably be working on some of the challenges in here. I don't know if you guys want me to actually do one of the challenges now. But yeah, let's go through. See it sends us away. This is also so I can save my game. Last time it didn't save, and I actually had to redo all the stuff I did before. Fun stuff. Loading, please wait. Yep, alright, cool. So here we are. Back here, let's take a look at our atlas. In the Dragonfly Dojo. We need ten more gems. Four more dragonflies. And is, is he not working right now? Alright, so we still need those. Um, I know that that middle one there is, I believe, the kites, and then the other three are other missions. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. All right, so we need 10 more gems there. I don't know where that last gem is. So let's continue, and we have a new stone to put into this dragon. I know. The magic of this sacred rune will grant you the power of electric breath. Cool. So now I can breathe electricity. Electricity, it's fancy. Which means that we can now go over. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me get some of the gems over here, real quick. Because I saw them and I want them. I want them. Give them to me! Because I know there's a, there's a golden gem over here. Just don't talk to the guy. Good. Yeah, we can't we can't go there yet. That's cloud nine. We're not allowed there yet because of rules. And I hate rules. Good, so now you see over here there's a bunch of gems we have not collected yet, which is good. I'm just gonna go through and uh collect the gems. And this is actually where our next area is. See? Hey Spyro, check out this big lock. 
It's surrounded by magical energy. I bet you can unlock it if you zap it with your electric breath. Don't forget to switch your breath ability by tapping the B button. You never know when you're going to need it. The reason I skipped over that is because... That's bubble breath. Alright! I'm going to switch to bubble breath now, actually, because I believe there is a dragonfly around here. Press and hold the Y button. Look around. Yep. Alright, well, guys. We unlocked that area. That's good. Uh, let's head back up to the middle now. Because next episode, what we're going to do is we're probably going to um, work on some of the uh, challenges in the Dragonfly Dojo as much as we can. Alright. So let's actually head up there now. Yeah. Alright, well guys, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. If you really enjoyed it, please be sure to hit that subscribe button right in the top uh, corner. Other than that, I've been the Asian Link, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!